Hey guys, welcome back to episode four of this uh, Let's Play. And uh, if you remember the last time we left off, we did a bit of progress. We went to the first day of school, uh, first day of university, which I think went pretty well for all three of them. Uh, we have our three ladies here. We have Julia, we have Becca, and we have Poppy. And Poppy's our starter girl. She's the one that we uh, began this playthrough with. But she also has these two roommates, uh, Becca and Julia, and the three of them are going through this college university experience together. Uh, and for right now, it looks like we don't have to focus too much on Poppy and Julia because their aspirations take us outside of uh, university experience. But Becca, on the other hand, uh, her aspiration has to do a lot with college. So... We're not going to be fo shifting our focus, obviously, because we have three of them to uh, make it through college. But we'll definitely, for a little bit, be doing a little more with Becca, just so that her aspirations get hit, and uh, so that she reaches the end goal. Uh, whoops. Which would be a senior scholar. Because once she's done with college, the only way to get any of this stuff is to go back. And I don't want to switch aspirations, because I have never done this one before. I've never done the college, uh, the academic milestones. What is this? Yeah, academic. I've never done this one before, so I'd like to be able to finish it and uh, see what that has to offer. So we will continue playing all three of them. We'll just be doing a little bit more with Becca so that she can... She can get her shit together. Oh my- oh! My girl's crying. Like, sobbing. Jesus. Oh. Oh, she's so sad. What is this? Wake up. Wake up, wake up. I wanna- s this is a note? Can you leave notes for people? Let's have her be nosy and see what this says. What's Poppy doing? Um, oh my goodness. Pretty good. Oh, oh no. You know what I love? Getting up and walking out of my room and stepping into a puddle of who knows what left by who knows who that's been sitting there for who knows how long. Oh gosh, I love it. It's so, so much. Oh. Well, first off, somebody keeps leaving a ton of food here. It's going to start going bad. And we have this keg machine over here. Don't think anybody's used it yet. Uh, we just purchased it. We haven't actually used it, which I think is okay. Maybe someone will have a, a party and we can put it to good use. Okay, so she, Poppy has her homework done. Oh my god, Flat, go away. Oh, let's have her be mean. Because she has that mean trait, right? She might actually enjoy saying, get the heck out of here. Can you please go? I need my computer. Oh. Can she... <gasps> she can fight him! She's probably gonna lose. Let's have her fight him. And then if she wins, then she can have bragging rights. I know she's chatting with him? She already doesn't like him. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh! Oh gosh. Poppy win. You have to win this. You gotta show everybody. If you defeat a vampire in, in universe- Yes, she did it! Oh, she's got a better potato. It's fine. They despise each other. Oh, that went- That went super fast. Uh, okay, go away. And I saw that. No, reputation. Oh, okay. That would be so cool if we could have her be like a politician or something like that, and have a terrible reputation. Oh my god, that would be so much fun. Be a little too close to real life, but I think that that would be fun. 
Let's do... She's hungry, but I think food can wait right now. Hungry and bladder. Oh, don't eat this. I'm just gonna take this away. Confiscate that. Let's have her use the bathroom. And get something to eat that's not disgusting. And Julia's still sleeping. But Julia's also hungry. Let's have her get the leftovers from here. I saw that there were only two hours left in one of the other things, and I don't know how long she's gonna sleep. But uh, if she at least gets something from the refrigerator, it'll be better quality than what's left over there. I do think it's pretty funny that he, Vlad, went from this computer to using this one. What is he doing? Probably trolling the forms. I don't like you because you wore purple pants yesterday and I don't like purple pants. I feel like that would be something that he would say. I do love this keyboard effect though. I'd be so distracted by it though, to be honest. Let's see. So she She's so confident for beating someone up. Yeah, I kind of like the idea of her just being mean to everybody because... Oh, and they become confident after winning a fight, so that's perfect. Oh, thank God he's leaving. So she likes being mean or mischievous, so she could probably do both. And I've never had a sim with negative reputations, so that would be fun to see as well. But what if she also goes into, uh, well, shoot, okay, so her first job that she had was with sports, right? So I guess we could go that route as well, because you can also have a lot of friends through the sports career too. Uh, so we could go a couple different ways. We could keep it vanilla and how she used to do it, where she was in the sports career, but we could have her be like a really evil sports player, because I think that she would probably want to... She's active, so she'd probably want to be a team player. So she could be like a really terrible team player that everybody hates, but she's just so good at her job that they have to keep her around anyways. Or we could have her go like the politician route, or we could do, I think for her degree, she could do social media. I'm not sure because I was, I didn't want to spoil myself too much. I was just kind of looking at what the degree entails, and I think the last one was social media. So she could also go into social media and do something there. Uh, I'm not sure. Let's see where that takes us. Okay, so everything... Oh, everything is not complete. Oh, two days. Let's see if there's a guest lecture available. It's housing. No. Okay, so this will have to be after class. And Poppy has finished her term paper, so let's... Oh, but she wants to eat, right? Yeah, let's have her eat something first. He's eating a whole lobster on her bed? Oh no, it's just a tail. Wow. Oh my god, that's- oh! I kinda wanna read this note. There's someone who's not busy, she's still sleeping, she's just eating, she's almost done with washing her hands. Let's have her read this note too. I wish I could leave notes for people and be like, excuse me, you were snoring too much. I don't appreciate this. Dear roommate, please clean me so I know that you care. No, just don't put me down, you monster. Love the dish you used. Oh, that's funny. Someone's not, oh. Someone's not doing their dishes. Okay. So, let's see what we can do with uh, Becca since Julia and Poppy are busy. She hasn't done this. Submit her term. Oh, she hasn't submitted her term paper yet? Oh, that's right. She finished it. S submit. And I think because she already edited it once, already edited it once, um, she cannot. She, like the plagiarized. The plagiarized uh, s selection is gone now. And then. I guess we could have her try doing the homework for that. 
I just, like, I'm, there's a part of me that's panicking, thinking, like, oh my god, what if I fail at least one of them? I think it would make for a compelling story. Let's have you... Oh, he's not dead. Okay. I think it would also make for a compelling story if one of them did fail, but I don't want any of them to fail because I like them all so much, you know? Like, when you have uh, characters that you're rooting for and you don't want anything to bad to happen to them, you just gotta protect them at all cost. Uh, that's kind of how I feel with these these ladies. I don't want anything to happen to them. But what can we do, Poppy, for you? Submit your term paper. I don't think you've edited it yet. No. Uh, edit term paper. Submit. Okay, let's, so let's edit this first. Move class in one hour. Uh, oh, she just blinked in and out of existence for a second. I'm not sure how long this is going to take, so I'll have to keep an eye on the time. And I kind of want to stick with her now. Today, seven hours. Homework is not done. So it's physics two. Once I'm going to do that. Thirty six minutes. Let's just have her go to class and come back and do this. All right, so four hours, everything here is complete. She just needs to do the exam. Okay, finish course with an A. So I think in the meantime, since she doesn't really have anything to do, let's have her study. Oh, that's homework. Literature. I think it's right, right? Yeah, the right expectations. So let's have her study that. Oh, she's so happy. She's feeling energized, but she doesn't have enough exercise. Okay, we'll just study a little bit, and then you can go and do a bit of exercise. What is that noise? Oh. Oh. I... <laughs> okay, I was like, this is... I was like, where the hell did this gnome come from? But this is not our bedroom. They're just doing their homework in their own bedroom. Girl, get your stuff together. Go. Just go. You need to use the restroom. You need to get cleaned up. Oh, I see. I want to give her a makeover so bad. Like these shoes and this top. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. But I have to I have to be strong. What does this one do? It's flirt. Oh, it's playful. Well, let's turn that off right now. We could actually use this near. The oh, there's so many. Use this near the keg. I have forgotten where the keg is. There you are. Mm. Let me put this. Let's see if it's in the corner. See, it's times like this when I feel like it's the most tedious to play The Sims when you're just waiting around, which is why they have the fast forward, but I don't want to fast forward. So we'll keep at it. I don't know if this is the skin set that I- because I do have a custom skin set uh, installed, and I'm not sure if it's a skin set that gives them these little pinky toes and knees, but I think it's so cute. And I think her hands too, right? Her hands are a little pinky. Super adorable. Julia, are you done? Yes, yes. Presentation and term paper. Okay, let's have you actually... I think we have a little bit of time. Where is the bedroom here? Let's have you do the board. Hope you turned in her homework confidently that class and squeezed every bit of knowledge out of it she could. That kind of effort will surely be great help. Perfect. Okay, so she has a bit of time now, so she still has to do homework, but let's have her do that term paper. I think once that stuff is out of the way, then that'll be really nice to just focus only on homework, you know? Like these, the boards and the term papers, I think are uh, 
a top priority because the homework can be done anywhere basically, but for the term paper and for the board you need to have those items with you. Uh, well, homework can be just taken anywhere. But it's, oh, it's still early in the morning. Okay. Ours is an afternoon class, class in one hour. Okay, so I think that she can go to class now since homework is done. She just has to do the final exam. And still working on that, these two ladies. No. Oh. Yeah, I'm... that's okay. As I said before, I do have the MC uh, Command Center uh, active for this just because I like some of the perks that it gives and some of the neighborhood calling sometimes. I, I like that as well. And there was one playthrough I was playing a scientist and she... I wanted to have her story be like she was exploring the cosmos and she has an alien baby and if you played the vanilla game then only men can get impregnated with an alien baby so I did a couple of tweaks so that she could have the baby instead and this turned out to be a really cute playthrough uh, but then something happened with the game and I lost all of that progress so it's good to finally get back into the game and not really be sure what I want to do because uh, sometimes when I create sims like I would go through the generator and create sims like that and have them tell me, tell me their story. But with this, it's just like all caution to the wind. I have no idea what's going to happen, what's going to uh, go on. And I kind of like that, you know, because it gives a refreshing feel to the game. Especially since I've been playing this game for years and uh, some of the new expansion packs and stuff like that haven't been so interesting content-wise. Uh, and I know it's a hot take, but I really enjoyed the Strangerville uh, expansion. Well, it's not a really expansion, right? I don't know what you want to call it. But um, I really enjoyed that pack a lot because it was fresh and it had a, a linear storyline. And it, I will admit it was a little tedious at times, but I really liked the idea of your sim becoming this hero and everybody recognizing them and getting fan mail and stuff like that. I thought that was so cute. And I really like the touches that I had for that. Oh, I want to give her a makeover too. I really like this family a lot. It's the Yersin family. And it feels really, um... Oh man, what is it called? Northern European-ish? I guess? And there have been many playthroughs where I'll get married to the daughters or something. Well, not me, but my sims will get married to the daughters, or they'll have something entwined with the daughters of this family, because I like that family a lot. Alright, this is looking pretty good. Okay, so she's done. Poppy is done as well. Perfect timing. Time paper. Let's submit it. And there she goes. She, got, she has some free time, so let's work a little bit on her aspiration. Well, Becca's in class, so introduce yourself to five more Sims. Oh, this is a celebrity. Derek Dreamer. I'm pretty sure he is also a Sim from an, a previous Sim game. That name is super familiar, and I know I've seen him around a lot. Oh, she has to go to the toilet. Okay. What's going on with Becca? It's noon. She needs fun. Well, where'd she go? She jogging. By the way, I can't keep up with you. Instead, can we have you go jogging? Oh, she went upstairs already. There she is. And because she's an active sim, jogging is fun for her. But of course her energy and hygiene will be going down, so I'll have to make sure that she doesn't pass out while she's outside. And for once, Julia's actually really good to go. Which class is this? Okay. Okay. So she's prepared. Enough. Prepared enough. You haven't gone to the bathroom yet? 
Oh, girl, come on. Oh, she just went right through that table. Alright. Let's see. Did she introduce herself? That was a cele- oh, she did. Nice. I'm gonna say, I know that it's difficult for them to introduce themselves to celebrities because celebrities uh, require people to be of a certain standing for them to want to interact with them. We have three friends, so... Should definitely work on Becca and Julia being friends with her. Oh no, just with her, because she has a slightly bad reputation. People are already hating her. Oh, she's gonna take a nap. Is there anyone else here that we can introduce ourselves to? Doesn't look like. Okay, so let's actually go to sleep in your own bed. Becca, let's come home. And get tidied up a little bit. Is she tired? We take it from looking out and low energy. Oh, her fun didn't even go up that much at all. Okay, well, I don't want to have to have them play video games all the time, but that might have to be the case for now. Oh no, she can't go sleep. She has to go straight to class. Oh, I hope that it'll be okay. Back is still going good. Pop is taking a nap. Class isn't for a while. Poor Becca. I wonder if she's going to be able to survive through that class. And I still have six days left in the term, so I don't need to worry about the guest lecture too soon. But I should not wait too long because otherwise she's not going to be able to um to get that done. I know that she has extra extra classes that she needs to take after this because you need an X amount of classes to be able to pass, but it would be nice to get as much done as possible. Is she crying? I don't think she's crying. Oh, but he is super stinky. Both of them? They're both super stinky. Oh, who is this lady? Just a young adult. There's so much food here. I'm surprised that all of this is still pretty good. A lot of omelets. Made by three different people. Oh, come on. Okay. Finish reading three books. We still have time. 18 hours. Submit a term paper. Okay, so she's- oh. Are you doing your homework or are you pretending to? Oh, you know what? Poppy should be friends with um, Lilith. Because isn't Lilith like a bad- yeah. She should be friends with Lilith. Because I think Lilith is like the badass of the twins. No, you don't have to come home. Just... Poor Becca. Uh, 17 hours, physics 1. She's fine. She's just fine. I don't understand why the other sims are not taking showers though. Like she is she is pretty stinky too. Okay, well at least he is. He was also very stinky. Are there doors actually? Lock for Okay, cool. Lock for everyone but roommates. But when you say roommates. Okay, so let's... Where's my room? Here's my room. So let's lock door for everyone but roommates. Because I have a feeling that if I put that on the other doors, then it might say my roommates. Instead of the roommates that are in that place, you know? And I don't want to lock other students out of their places. Oh! She's so dirty. She is so dirty. Poppy's still sleeping. Oh, how's she doing actually? Pretty good. Let's have her do some homework. Boring, boring homework, huh? 
Oh my god, she's only 20 rupees at a time. Okay, so Becca's done. Becca, can you come home and sleep? And if you sleep for two hours, we can maybe make it to a lecture. Because I start at five. Five and seven. Oh, okay, so... If I skip the 5 o'clock one and just go to the 7 o'clock one, then that might be better for her. Because then she can have some time to sleep. Have a few hours. Oh, you know what? Is he technically a roommate? Maybe. Okay, Julia's 50% done. Let's get back with some sleep. She is so close to passing out wherever she is. Oh my god, don't sleep the whole day. Oh, that paper looks really, really rough. Oh, I wonder if there are any more notes. Let's go note hunting a little. Oh, oh no, wait, that's just food. Let's clean up a little. Oof. That's pretty bad. This is nine hours, eight hours, no, sorry. Three hours, 45, or 49 minutes, an hour. So let's steal that. Oh, uh, what? Lady, I think you should. Okay. Get out of here. Go have a shower and get out of here. Oh my god, Poppy, come on. Okay, Becca's going good. And she is just doing her homework. Alright. A lot of grinding, a lot of homework. Can I attend a lecture? Actually, I can't. Um, let's do this one. What if, what if Becca becomes a teacher? You better run your buns! Oh, she's just such a miserable. Okay, so she at least needs one A. Which... <gasps> Ooh. Pop okay, so that popped up. Let me see if there's anything actually available. This is the rival college, I think, right? Very neat study session. Oh, they have the robots here. I was like, where the heck is the robot place? But there, it's the art society over here. Uh, which is fine. I think that's okay. Game day. I don't really, I'm not really concerned about debates right now. Can she make it? Okay. Does this count? Oops, does she have to sit through the whole thing? Maybe. We'll see. We'll keep, we'll keep an eye on it. And see what she has to do there. And then... <gasps> An acquaintance was telling me how much they dislike you. Try being a little nicer. Becoming disliked is a slippery slope. Oh boy. I wonder if it was Vlad. Vlad is the only person who really dislikes her. Uh, I forgot, she just stopped she doing homework. Okay. I was like, I already forgot what I made her do. Oh! They're not playing together though. That's a lot of, that's a lot to listen to. Oh, what can I do with Julia? Julia wants to read, right? Let's have her read. I don't have any books. Is there a bookshelf here? There it is. Uh, reads. Oh, I can purchase books from here too. What's this? This is Children and Fantasy. Let's have her read the first unicorn. She's happy.
She's so... Okay, finally. Finally, other people are starting to take showers. And how are you coming along with you? You're 50% done. Okay, so I think that when Becca finishes that, she'll be good to go. Oh. Oh, thank you. Thank you, nice person. I wish that I could build uh, on this line. There are cheats to be able to do it, but I wish that I could build a desk somewhere around here to put this computer on so that there are more places for people to sit. And I think we are going to have the girls go to bed and then we can finish off a day there. So let's have Julia finish reading that book. Oh. Man, okay, I'm gonna have to decline again. Maybe next time. Maybe I think it's only at night time, but I think that this episode's already getting a little bit too long. So the next time that she gets a call for a party, we should go to the party just to let loose, have a good time. Her energy's pretty good. And how's her homework? Seventy-five. All right, let's have her sleep after that. She's about half long. Almost halfway done with that. And Becca, oh Becca, you're almost done. She did it. And she's having a terrible time. All right, so let's have her come home and use the toilet. Did it count? It counted, nice. Uh, so let's have her use the toilet and then go to bed. And then same thing for Julia. Let's get these ladies off to bed at a decent time. Instead of because I think the last time they went to bed at like 3 o'clock in the morning? Gosh, I don't even remember. But it would probably be a bad idea to continue doing that again. Oh my god, there's another ghost. Who is this? Huh? It's the same ghost. Let's see. He looks very old timey. I mean, not necessarily like old timey, but like maybe he came here in the 19. No, I don't even want to pretend I know what I'm talking about here. Can you hire repair service? Yes, okay, so when you're done using the bathroom, you are going to go and sleep. And Julia wants to... Yeah, we can stop now. You read most of the book. Oh, finish. But she didn't finish it though. Are you stuck? No. Okay, good. Let's have her hire someone to fix this. Oh, she's fixing it. Okay, well, that takes care of that. And then Julia, let's have you go sleep. You can worry about this mess in the morning. Not really your concern right now. So, don't worry about it. Come on. You're stuck. Oh, why are you stuck? No, you're fine. Alright. Alright. Getting into bed almost by 10 o'clock. What? You can do it. Is it this? It's... Can, can I put this in my mouth? There. Is that, was that one in your way? That was not in your way. What is, what is in the way? It's, oh! Is that what it is? Is Julia not a roommate? That doesn't... That seems a bit weird. Alright. Now, these ladies have finally gone to bed. And I think that this is a perfect place to stop. Uh, again, in summary, got another day of school under their belt. And uh, got some papers written. Got the board work done a little bit. So I think that we are doing good so far. We can only wait and see until what the final grades say. 
It still says term day is off six, so I don't know if that resets uh, at midnight or what, but we'll figure it out next time. Uh, in the meantime, thanks for joining, thanks for watching, and if you have any comments, questions, or concerns, just let me know down below. And if you like this, then please like this video, and if you want to give me a subscribe, then that would be fantastic, so you can continue to watch these ladies as they uh, go through their lives. Thanks for joining me again. Alright guys, bye!